if I do that. Hey, crafty friends. Hello, everybody. Okay, so I asked about meet me with some die cuts, and pretty much unanimously, everybody said let's do it again. So we're gonna do it again, and so here's the rules again. Okay. Every month has a theme. Every month you will be paired with a different partner. You can come in and go out anytime you want to. If you have a problem, I'll solve it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, if you have a problem, all you have to do is let me know. Please, please, please. Let me know. Um, I don't know, people. Yeah, I'll take care of it. I mean, I understand stuff happens, you know. Just within this week, I learned that someone has not fulfilled their end for the last three months. Oh, wow. And they've been having conversation. And I understand that. But... I'm I'm gonna I'm taking care of it now. So if there are more of you out there, let me know, please. You know, I said from the beginning, I said every time I do a video, a lot of times I know y'all, sometimes I don't. Sometimes I make a new friend this way. Um but you know the bottom line is to be respectful of your new friend, of me of you know the whole process because it's a it's a awesome thing to be a part of when you meet a new friend and you exchange you know new stuff to play with so um it can be you know don't say okay so january is going to be winter and slash valentine's day so you know don't say oh i don't have anything winter so i can't play that's not the way it goes I give you a category to work with, and then you can contact, when you when I give you your contact person, y'all can talk and say, you know, if you say, well, you know, I don't, I don't really have anything winter, but I have a ton of Valentine's stuff. And so, if that's fine with your partner, that's fine. If it's not, all you gotta do is contact me. I'll give you another partner. Or, you know, you might say, well, I don't have anything winter, but I have you know, something Christmas, or, you know, whatever. It's about making a new friend and swapping die cuts. Okay, so then, the next thing is, I usually send two or three of each thing I send in different paper selections. But keep in mind your postal budget, you know, um, and keep in mind sending what you would like to receive. So, there's no minimum, there's no maximum. Just be considerate. Do unto others as you would have them do unto you. And enjoy it. <clears throat> it is so much fun. And I have seen, I have a lot of dies, okay? Um, but, but, I have, there is very little that I have gotten that I had, which blows my mind. And, and there are some things that I have loved so much that, that I've sought them out, you know, and then I've I bought them for myself because I, I loved them and I, I'll use them a lot. Yeah. Or even paper collections that you loved that you didn't have. Right, right. And so, it, it's called Meet Me With Some Die Cuts, but you can also send stamped images. And I, t and I shuffled around the idea of swapping stamped images. And um, I had a lot of people say, I'm not real comfortable stamping something and sending it to somebody else. I don't like my stamping, you know. And so, yeah. that's fine. So, that's why we stuck with die cuts. And so, um, but within that theme, you can send anything. Like, you could send heart stickers or, you know, skate stickers or stamped images. It's up to you and your partner what you swap, Okay. But, you know, die cuts are the, the main the main idea of the thing. Um, it, each 
each month starts at the beginning of the month and you should have your dies sent to your partner before the end of the month because the following month will start a new swap and it'll be a new theme. Um, and a new partner. And a new partner, yeah. So, uh, again, if you don't receive anything, if your partner is not conversing with you, you know, if, if there's any problem, please let me know. Please. And and don't be soured if something happens. Because I'll make it right for you. Because my bottom line is that we're a community and, you know, the people that I've met doing this, they're incredible friends now. And, I don't know, it's, it's just been a blessing, I think. So... And that being said, um, there have been situations where I've had to do a lot of die cutting. <laughs> yeah. But that's okay, because guess what? Then I got to have a new friend, too. You know? I got to have more than one new friend. <laughs> hey, hey, you know what? I need to report that uh, 11 months ago, and I think 11 and a half months ago, I didn't receive anything from my partner. As I recall... I was at your house not too long ago, and I cut you out enough rosettes to last you a lifetime. Would this be a true? Would this be a true statement or a false statement? It's true. I'm just reporting that my very first one did not send me anything. Yeah, and that's a prime example. If it happens to the bestie, and y'all, yeah. I have to tell this story because it's hysterical. And so, and so, such a bestie story is that the person I paired her with wrote her and I both this extensive letter on how happy and thrilled she was that she got bestie, that she felt like she had a celebrity, and that she was, yeah. <laughs> she was honored and thrilled. Bestie sent her her die cuts, and guess what bestie got? Crickets. <laughs> I was like, oh, well, I guess fame just uh, swept her away. Wait a minute. I think I did hear from email. I got a couple of emails. But that was all. Yeah. And I even, I, I contacted her and said, look, you know, is there a problem? Blah, blah, blah. Crickets. So, you know, it, it happens. It happens. And, and like I said, there's health situations where, you know, you can't help it. And, and that's fine. There are. There are no bad feelings. There are no bad feelings. Um, but here is the thing: if you do, if you don't communicate with me that there's a problem, and you flake on somebody, that's a problem. You know, I can't help it, but it's a problem. Do what you say, say what you do, stay to your word, and everything's cool. <laughs> that's right. That's right. Just go with it and have a big time. So, anyway, I hope, you know, I, I had a lot of ladies last year who were, you know, they stuck in there every month, you know. And I've had several emails already saying, are you going to do it next year? Are you going to do it? And so, yeah, I'm going to do it. I am. It's fun. So, let me say, here's my piece of paper. Ladies. Lise Gaines, Michelani, Christine Lee, you're about to get something in the mail from me. Just saying. So, there's that. Okay, well, um, my email will be in the description box below. You need to email me because I need your email. Um, and I would like to have your address too. I didn't ask for that in the beginning last year, but there were situations where... I wanted to send something to you, and then I didn't have your address, but your partner did. So, if you don't mind, you know, I would like that, too. So, what I do is, um, I get a list going, and then I just I start separating people, you know, no rhyme or reason. And, um, and then I'll email both of you with the other person's email address, and then y'all contact each other, and the rest of it is on y'all, okay? Unless there's a problem. Um, and so, you know, it's fun. It's 
fun stuff. And uh, I got, I got, I, that's one of the things I'm going to do is go through what I have left that I got from last year's and make embellishments out of everything. Uh, and that's pretty stinking exciting. Because last year we started in January, but we started with spring, Easter, and um, because it was, that's just like when it came to me. And I was like, oh, so this time we're going to start with winter and Valentine's Day and then go spring, Easter and on down the line. And if y'all have any ideas for different categories that aren't on here, you know, by all means, let me know and we can add it to a month or whatever. Because uh, basically, I went to some of the crafty websites and looked at categories that they, that they have like, um, you know, whatever... Whatever season you want to look up or whatever. And these are kind of the the categories. All the categories that I could find. So, if there's anything that's not on this list that y'all think of, you know, shoot me a line. Absolutely. So, anyway. I, oh, yeah. You never know. You never know. I don't have any... Uh, COVID ephemera on here, but then again, I don't have any COVID ephemera either, but we all have a mask, don't we? <laughs> yeah. Oh, there are already. There are. I I just don't have any. But, um, anywho, there that is. And, um, my email will be below. Y'all shoot me a line and I'll shoot you a partner and have fun. All right. I love you guys. Blessings. Good morning.